She's devastated. She just buried your uncle alone. I did it for her. Sebastian, Anne can't bear the thought of turning you in, but... What? Turn me in? She saw what happened. I'll give you some time to think, Sebastian. Hey, uncle, go. Merk. Sebastian. Did you hear that? You saw what happened. I never wanted to hurt my uncle. I know. I can't believe he's gone. How did things go so wrong? I didn't mean it. I didn't mean to... Oh, Anne, I was only trying to help. I can't leave now. Anne needs me more than ever. You understand. You can talk to Ominous. Make him understand. He listens to you. I need to be with Anne. I don't know what to do, Sebastian. You don't know. You do know. Anne has no one. I regret everything I did. I know what I did was wrong. I only hope she can forgive me. That everyone can forgive me. No matter what happens from here, I'm glad we met. Poor Sebastian. Ominous. What a mess. I can't believe it. After I last saw you, I went straight to Hogwarts. Before I had time to talk to Black, I heard from Anne. I rushed to Feldcroft and found her with Solomon's body. She was beside herself with grief. Part of her wants Sebastian to face the consequences, another part can't bear the thought of it. I don't want to lose Sebastian, but I don't think we have a choice. Man, what the hell do I do? Turn him in? I ain't no snitch. I ain't gonna turn my man's in. You gotta, that's your decision. I ain't got nothing to do with that. We do have a choice. What good will it do to turn him in now? He clearly regrets everything. He's not going no to snitch. do anything like this again. We've both heard that before. But we also need to think about Anne. She's lost her health. Now she's lost her uncle. Do you really want to take her brother away from her too? I... I understand what you're saying. Perhaps you're right. As much as I believe that Sebastian should pay for his actions, we'd only be punishing Anne as well. I hope we're doing the right thing. I'll talk to Anne. If it comes from me, she'll agree with this decision. Thank you, Ominous. You're a good friend. What I don't know, though. Lies he murked his own uncle. He could do whatever together. to me. You murk your own that uncle. It I don't know. even matter. I might regret this.
I'm going to make sure I ain't had no upgrades. Uh, where are you? I hope Professor Fig got my owl. I need to tell him and the keepers that Ranrock knows where the last repository is. According to the owl I received, Ranrock is moving more quickly than we could have anticipated. This is grave news indeed. We had hoped for more time to discuss the best path forward. Let us hear what the student has to say. Professor, you received my owl. Ranrock has the last of Bragball's journals. He killed Loggok to get it. He knows where the last repository is. Godric's heart. Loggok. Lodgok and Ranrock were brothers. Lodgok was bringing the journal to me. Ranrock is a monster. We need to know where the final repository is. Surely this changes things. Ranrock has Bragbor's journals and knows where the final repository is. We obliviated Bragbor. He kept journals? Why would he have documented all of this? He didn't know what we were containing. Isadora told Bragbor about the magic when she asked him to build a container for her. I've seen her memories. Isadora left memories for someone to find? You know what she did? Her memories showed what she did for her father, which I also saw in Professor Rookwood's pensive. And a conversation with Bragbor in which she expressed frustration about the limits being placed on her use of ancient magic. Based upon the memories they have seen, I believe our young friend is well aware of the grave circumstances in which we find ourselves. The next trial will involve an exceptional level of magical skill and a nuanced ability to interact with beasts. Find a face of stone and tendrils. I should advise you that you must engage with any beast that is part of the trial on your own. Professor Bakar will meet you in his pensive room. An exceptional level of magical skill? Nuanced ability to interact with beasts? Hmm. I suppose we should begin our search for a face of stone and tendrils, whatever that may be. Very well. Professor Weasley has been keeping an eye on me. Perhaps we should meet there, so she has no reason to raise concerns with Professor Black. I shall see you near the coast. Perhaps then you can tell me a little more about the memories of Isadora that you witnessed. Hello, madam. Is everything all right? I'm simply beside myself since Rococo ran away. He's my pet Niffler. I'm sorry to hear that your pet is missing. Thank you. I appreciate your words. I mean, I've had him for years. He's lovely company. Whilst on our morning constitutional the other day, south of here, he and I stumbled upon Henrietta's hideaway. They say that Henrietta was a paranoid recluse filled her castle with all manner of traps to keep thieves from pinching her valuables. As we drew near, the morning sun reflected off something in a window, and before I knew it, Rococo was off! 
I've been worried sick. But I'm not about to meddle with Merlin knows what's inside that house, or the Ashwinders that are lurking about. I'll keep an eye out for Rococo. Oh, that's terribly kind. But stay away from the hideaway. Far too dangerous. If someone does find him in the hideaway, they shall be well rewarded. Henrietta's treasures are theirs for the taking. She certainly won't mind now. What do you have for sale? What's brought you here today? That hideaway does sound intriguing. Perhaps I should investigate, for Rococo's sake. Can never have enough stock, that's what I say. Money though. Thank you for stopping by. Revelio. Alohomora. Well, we got a fighter. Must be the castle where Miss Coffee's Niffler ran away. How to find a way inside. I've used unforgivable. I've Ashwinders! I'd better find a way around them. Or perhaps through them. Rebellion. Freaking lucky gas. Uh. 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 Uh.
Go about saving goblins I know you're the one who stole our hippogriff. We've been looking. You're the one who uses the dark arts. Expulsion! I have no heels. A castle must have been quite stately in its time. Somebody else. Bombarda! Think of plenty! This castle. Flash of inspiration. Ah! Expulsion. Incendio. Expulsion. Crazy. What have you done? Oh, this is. The ah. pulse. Expendio. Oh, Quite a violent strike in this one. The My man's died a horrible, painful death. Knowing the meat he's likely studied here. name am I? Revelio. Incendio. Accio. Wingardium Leviosa. Bombarda. Incendio. Thank you. 
More treasure. Rico. There we go. Ashwinders. If I likes it, I takes it. Lumos. Now you've done it. Your brother. It's your new trick, Rhodes, little savior. These coins must have come from Miss Coffee's Nephla. What a dreadful <sighs> Revelio. Treasure. That Nephla's certainly leaving quite a trail. Rebellion. More rush winders. Then it was ours. Come on. 
I shall cast my eyes closer, best to be sure. Well, girl, didn't you? I did it, and an Ashwinder, no less. Revelio. Incendio. Revelio. Bombarda. Incendio. Incendio. Levioso. I might as well grab the Neffler. I'm here now.
realized how tiring it can be to capture a Niffler. Revelio. Rebellion. The heck am I trap? So I gotta figure out how to get out of here. All right, so we see, didn't find that treasure. Fuck that place, but we got her little bird. So we just gonna give her the bird and call it a day on that one with this quest. Miss Coffee, I found your Niffler. Oh goodness, really? Oh, thank you. You're very brave. I was at my wit's end. How's my sweet Rococo? May I have him back? It wasn't easy battling Ashwinders and finding a Niffler in that house. I've earned a reward. Oh, of course. I didn't realize you'd done all that. That was a lot of work. Anything for my precious baby. Oh, my brave little explorer. My greedy, greedy boy. Oh, I can't wait to get him home. Thank you again for what you did. From now on, I'll keep Rococo on a lead whenever we go out. Ah, there you are. I should investigate. Rebellion.
handy resource indeed. You're... You're here. I have good news. We do not have any of Ranrock's loyalists to contend with. Of course, the bad news is that it's likely because they no longer need to track the Keepers for information. This place could do with a bit of pruning. Let's look around. Glaciers! Rebellion! Bombarda! Glaciers! Careful now. These vines are as dry as kindling. Incendium. Is that a... It is. I believe I know what must be done. Revelio. Do you recognize the head sculpted there? It looks like a grap horn. And the prints carved into the ground lead me to believe that a grap horn will somehow open the way forward. That's what Professor Rackham meant when he spoke of my needing an ability to interact with beasts. It would seem so. I do know that the last of a long dynasty of grap horns lives nearby. They call him the Lord of the Shore. I suspect you'll need to bring him here. What happens next, I can't say. If that's what must be done, I'll do it. Excellent. I know this area well enough. When you see the remains of a large sea creature, you're in the right place. Now, Professor Rackham made it clear that you must engage with any beast that is part of this trial on your own. So I shall wish you good luck and wait for your return in the map chamber. This must be the place. Very well, Lord of the Shore. Show yourself. Thank <laughs> you. 
Glaciers. Stump me out. Stump the shit out of me. Uh, Slow down awesome. now. Let's there we go. go. Ah. It's a wrap.
Time to put our Griffin to work, y'all. Time for jaunt, I'd say. Rebellion. Perhaps Professor Rakham was right to have had faith in you. I still have my reservations. Isadora, as you will see, was not who she seemed. I can only hope that you are. My memories should answer any questions you may have about the power you will need to protect. Thank you, Professor Bakar. I shall see you back in the map chamber. Rebellion. Hello? Isadora? Isadora? I'm glad you're here. Isadora was not at her home. I know. Her father. Oh, Percival. What is it? It is as though he was stripped not only of his pain, but of all emotion. Everything is much worse than I feared. Neve was right. Isadora hasn't stopped. I've just learned that she has been wielding that magic on students. We must gather the others. What have you done? Take 
your breath. Students, Isadora. Everyone feels pain. And why? Because of your arrogance? Your obsession with secrets? He won't suffer any longer. Not my father. Not my students. No one. Isadora. Set down your wand. Professor, you taught me to hone my power, not throw it away. I did not teach you this. Expelliarmus! <laughs> He had to do what he had to do. She's a wolf. Caverns below Hogwarts, where you fought Isadora. Is that the location of the final repository? It is. You see, we could not destroy the strands of emotion Isadora had stolen from so many. So we did all that we could to keep them safe. We also realized that until they could be destroyed, the magic used to create them was a danger to wizard kind. Hence, we became keepers. Keepers of an unfathomable secret. We knew that someday, one with the ability to see traces of ancient magic might be seduced by its power. We built the trials to lead that person to us. To allow them to prove themselves worthy of the knowledge we'd kept hidden and the responsibility that accompanies it. Have I not proven myself, Professor? I need to get to that repository before Ranrock does. You have, and you will. But the repository is protected by powerful ancient magic. To enter, you must craft a special wand from the four artifacts you found above our pensives. So the repository is safe from Ranrock for now. If he is, as you suspect, capable of using the power of the other repository, I fear he will be able to breach our defenses. Then I must go now and craft this wand. Perhaps Mr. Ollivander will help me. Another Ollivander? I'm not surprised. As I am sure he will tell you, this wand may be used for only one purpose. Return with the wand, and we will open the way forward. I shall send an owl ahead to Ollivander. Whilst you visit him, I'll reach out to Professor Weasley. Professor Weasley? Yes. I may have made an error in judgment by not informing her of Ranrock's intentions earlier. I only hope it's not too late. If Ranrock really is going to try to drill below Hogwarts, we'll need all the help we can get. All right, Professor. I'll see you soon. <laughs> 